Hey guys, listen, I'm new around here, and those guys back on the beach really do not know how to show hospitality for a hungry lady. Looking for somewhere to eat? Beef Wellington, hmm? Drift, be cool. I'd love some burgers. Know anyone who makes them around here? Well, you've got a few options. There's Dur Burger, Sticks, the Fish Restaurant. You do pretty good burgers. Or, counter proposal, I can make burgers for all of us. I really don't mind. I'm just starving. So, big question time. Would you like to come with me? Or me, Drift? Both. Let's do both, huh? Why not? What do you say, Midas? Then may the best man win. Then allow us both to accompany you for burgers. Great! I'm Jules, by the way. You're Drift, and you are... Midas. Well, Drift, Midas, let's get going. So if you stay real still, your mind will empty. That's why it's called mindfulness. Wow, that's amazing. How can one's mind be empty and full at the same time? It's just how it works, man. Clearly having an empty mind works for you. Hey! <laughs> you two are so catty. I'm surprised you aren't an old married couple. Me and Midas? An old married couple? Ugh. What's the matter? You don't think I'm handsome enough? No, man. I just imagined you in a wedding veil. And I've decided I don't ever want to imagine you in a wedding veil again. It's weird. I think he'd look pretty good in one. <laughs> Anyways, burgers are ready. Yay! Well, it certainly has been a lovely evening. Would you like one of us to walk you home? Hmm. No, but thank you. I don't live far from here. Are you sure? Absolutely. Thanks for a good time, guys. I'll be back around here tomorrow. Later. Dude, she's so hot. She's gorgeous. And very fun to be around. I think I like her. You gotta remember to breathe, bro. I am breathing, you fool. I can't do this without breathing. Just focus on your breathing. So who do you think she likes? I don't know if she likes either of us. Like that. Come on, dude. She's playing hard to get. I just can't tell with who. So you're saying if a girl doesn't show any signs of being into you but wants to hang out, she's playing hard to get. Yeah, duh. Oh, Drift. Hey, fellas. What are we doing today? Oh, hey. I'm teaching Midas not to be so grumpy all the time with mindfulness. Wanna join? Sure, why not? Empty my mind, oh wise guru. Ugh, I'm just going to make some lunch. Leftover burgers, anyone? Yes, please. Call me grumpy, spiky-headed man-child. She's so beautiful. I want to ask her out. But I can't tell if I should. She seems to be more into drift. Oh, this can't be. What a shame. What are you staring at? Uh, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Got you. I will find the way into her heart. <sighs> ah! That girl is drowning. Don't look at me. I just ate like two pizzas. And you're not supposed to swim after eating. Okay, I'll do it. It's okay, I'm coming. Are you okay? 
Now I am. How on earth did you get out there? You hurt. It doesn't matter, now that you're here. Uh... Can I feel your muscles? I better get going. No, stay! I'm feeling weak. Watch out, Jules. Looks like someone's coming for your man. <laughs> Watch it, Drift. Ooh, someone's jealous. Whatever. Let's just go get Midas and leave. You staying here all day, Midas? Nope, I'm coming now. Thank you for saving me. I'm sure I'll see you again. You guys go ahead without me. I'll be there soon. Okay, don't be too long. What kind of game are you playing? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, drop the act. I know the whole drowning woman scene was fake, and you do too. So? I'm with Midas, so find some other guy to follow around. Wow, you seem very threatened by me. I'll take it as a compliment. It's not. Well, then why are you so worried, hmm? Because you're stalking my boyfriend. Well, you can't prove it. Have a good day, Jules. I'm sure I'll see you around again. Oh, what a weirdo. What the? Where am I? Oh good, you're awake. You, you're crazy. Let me out of here. And let you go running back to Midas? No, I don't think so. Midas is mine. You're obsessed with him. He doesn't like you, Sonny. Take the hint. He doesn't like me because you're in the way. Once you're gone, he'll be a little more open-minded. He'll never want you. Just wait and see. Oh, Midas, please find me. Oh, man, these kids are getting better at this. Hello? Hey, Midas. Sonny? The one and only. You want to come get dinner with me? Sonny, I told you that I wasn't interested. Oh, I think you'll change your mind. I like Jules, Sonny. Now leave me alone. I don't think Jules will be a problem anymore. Wh what? <laughs> Bye, Midas. Oh, Jules! you see anything? Yeah, hang on. I've got it. She's this way. This is it. You go in and I'll keep watch. Thanks, Drift. Jules! Midas, you came for me. I'm so glad that you're okay. Midas, I thank you for saving me. Of course. I, I love you, Jules. I love you too. Come on, let's get you out of here. Yeah, before she gets back. Jules, I'm glad you're okay. I never could have found you without Drift. What do you say we get out of here? Yes, please. Okay, okay, you were right. 
This place is pretty nice. Well, I'm glad you like it. I wanted to get away from the beach and the parties for a moment and show you what my personal taste is like. You're a classy guy, Midas. I never thought I'd actually feel comfortable in a place like this. Well, I'm glad you do. Would it be okay if I... Kiss me? I thought you'd never ask. Good evening, my lovelies. What the... Healy? What do you think you're doing here? Well, how do I put this? I'll be your waiter for the evening. You must be joking. Nope, I just started last week. What happened to the other guy? We were being served by someone else. He just finished his shift. Guess what? The manager said that I was doing so well that I might get bumped up to assistant manager, maybe. Congratulations, Peely. Fantastic. Well, can we order dessert? Of course. What can I get for you both? Looking lovely as always, Jules. Thank you, Peely. I think I'll have the grilled plantains. Okay. And I'll have the banana split. Strange choices, but you're the customer, I guess. I don't think Peely's much of a waiter. I can't believe he's here. Yeah, he kind of ruined our kiss. Oh, so you're just as annoyed as I am. Uh, yeah, of course. I don't want my romantic smooshes interrupted by my awkward banana friend. You want to go somewhere else? Can we? So the chef said we don't have any... Uh, what the... They can't dine and dash like that! Not on my watch! Ugh. Oh, come on, Midas. It's not that bad. I'm sure they still do ice cream with bananas. No more bananas. I'm losing my appetite. You know, I suppose that now that we're away from Agent Busboy Peely, maybe we might be able to pick up where we left off. That is a great idea. No way! Look who it is! You're joking. Guys, what are you doing here? Preparing to leave. We were on a date. Having, well, trying to have some privacy. Oh, well, don't let me stop you. Yeah, we're just gonna leave. Don't you guys want to get some food? No. No. Man, I don't get it. I thought it'd be fun to be their waiter. What a day. I can't believe that we've been denied our kiss at every moment. It's like the universe doesn't want it to happen. Huh? Yet. It happened yet. Oh, good. Well, what about now? I don't want to wait for the right moment to be spoiled by one of our ridiculous friends. Agreed. Oh, no. Jules, run! Wait! No need to say a word. I see it clear. You wanna have some fun? Yeah. I'm gonna rock you. What? <sighs> you forgot to pay your bill. I'm going slow. Hey there. Hey, where are we going? Far away from the beach. Oh? Where are we going? We're going for a boat ride. Alone at last. Finally. Guys! 
Please. <laughs> Healy, I thought I told you to stay away for one day. Just one. Maybe you should have told me where you were going to be. We both ended up on boat trips to avoid each other. <laughs> Now, where were we? Midas, I think maybe the moment has passed. I was afraid of that. You know, I was talking to the girls, and Bomber said that maybe we should go somewhere at night, somewhere no one else will be. That's not a bad plan. Then let's do it, because right now... The universe doesn't want it to happen. Huh? Yet! I mean yet! Are we alone? I think so. That was... Something special. Yay! Huh? Huh. That better be an ice cream truck. He's driving pretty fast, huh? Drift? Uh, I think we should get off the road. Yeah, he's not slowing down. Move! What the? Who was that maniac? I have no idea, but he nearly killed us. Did you hear something? Ugh, what a jerk. Why would somebody do that? I don't know, but he's getting closer. I'm gonna give this guy a piece of my mind. Hey, listen up, you lunatic. What the? Oh. My. Can you give me a ride home? I don't live too far. Sure! <laughs> well then hop on in. See you another time, Jules. Wow, Ruby. So, he just blew up the agency, and then that was that. I go to Shark Island, and he runs off. Unbelievable. None of that even sounds possible. Just as there are aliens in the sky, Midas was a supervillain who got all his friends sent to jail so he could get away scot-free. Wow. I have to rethink things. That's his truck. All right. You remember the plan? You and Drift cause a distraction and I'll fix things with Jules. You got it. Good luck. I just... I thought I knew him. But he's been keeping so many secrets. Yeah, well, he's a crook. And like, so am I. But at least I'm an honest one. Hey, my truck! Get back here! Okay, then. Jules? Midas, what are you doing here? What's going on with Brutus? Nothing. He was just telling me an awful lot about you and your shady past. How long were you going to keep all those secrets from me? Forever? 
Well, I was hoping that I could just erase my past, but I can't. Jules, I lied to you. Not directly, but I kept the truth from you. It's true, all of it. But I've been trying to be better. For me, and my friends, and you. I know you're not mine. I don't own you. But I guess what I'm trying to say is, you make me want to be a better man. Oh, Midas, you silly man. I'm sorry for running out on you. Can we rewind? Of course. <laughs> Dude, we totally stole his truck! Oh, no! There he is, the little twerp. You've gotten too big for your boots while I've been gone, Midas. You think you've walked away from this life, but you've forgotten who I am. And no one makes me look like an idiot in front of a pretty girl. Someone's gonna have to remind you who's really in charge. What on earth? What's happening? No! <laughs> I think that'll do for now. My house. I don't believe it! Blasted aliens! What am I gonna do now? Midas, I'm so sorry about what happened. Is there anything we can do? I'm afraid not. The house is gone. I'm staying with Peely at the moment. You look like you haven't slept. I haven't. He's insisted on watching all three extended versions of some fantasy movie series. Come on in. Well, you know, if Peely's house isn't working out, maybe we could talk about... oh... I don't know. Maybe you moving in with me? Move in with you? I know. Sorry. That's a terrible idea. No! I love the sound of it. Are you sure you don't mind? Of course not. I want to be closer to you all the time, Midas. I think it would bring us closer together. Hmm. You're not wrong. All right. Let's do it. Yay! This is going to be so good for us, Midas. I'm sorry, Jules, I just can't do this. Midas, what's gotten into you? Just an hour ago, we said this would be a great idea. You're already backing out of it? I'm sorry, Jules. I don't mean to mock your taste, but that house is minuscule. Teeny tiny. I can't live there. It's like sitting in a trash compactor. Okay, so clearly you have claustrophobia issues. Nothing wrong with that. How about we maybe look for somewhere new to live, huh? Somewhere with enough space for the both of us. Well, yes, I suppose that would be an improvement of the situation. I'm sorry, Jules, it's me, not you. I think we should go right away. Let's find the most perfect house for you and I to live out our lives and settle down together. Uh, really? Of course. I mean, you don't actually want to live there, do you? I kind of like my house. But if you really want to find a perfect forever home, let's do it. perfect house for you and I to live our lives and settle down together. So, they're getting all cozy and playing house. Not if I have anything to say about it.
Come on, Midas. Was dry cleaning really necessary? <laughs> Jules! Midas, where's your dry cleaning? No time to explain. We need to get out of here right now. Come on, are you serious? Yes, I'll explain on the way. We just need to get out of here. We're not safe. Are you going to tell me now, or are you just going to say no time to explain and then not explain when we're just driving around the island? Yes, of course. I do hate that in movies. So, it was Brutus who destroyed my home. Brutus is an alien? No, he stole an alien ship. Anyway, he wants me gone, or he'll hurt you and our friends. But I'm not going to run from him and give him what he wants. So what do we do? We find a new home, far away, where they can never find us. Then we get rid of him. Well, it's definitely out of the way. What do you think? Well, considering the alternatives, this is pretty cozy. Indeed. Wait until you see inside. Oh, it is pretty nice. But Midas, are you sure we're going to be safe? For now, my dear. Until I find out how to get Brutus out of our lives. We'll do it together. enjoyed that awesome video, make sure you subscribe. And don't forget to update your creator code to these seasons. And don't miss our next video, which will be out tomorrow on our other channel, Seasons 2.